Hi everyone, welcome back to the my channel. My name is Anil and in this Angular video tutorial, we will see that how we can install the Angular 10. So before going to start with the Angular, I'm just going to tell you that there is two things that must be installed in your system. One is Node and another one is the NPM. So if you already installed them, then that's great. If you are not installed yet, then the both link are given in the description box, one for the Ubuntu and another for the Windows. All right, when you install the Node, npm will automatically install in your system after that we need to install the angular cli i will tell you that with the live example also but here you can find that uh, i just provide the two links so when just run this command then you will find that uh, angular is installed but maybe you just get the older version right so i will tell you that how we can check uh, the current version and how we will find that uh, what version of installed in our uh, command line then uh, if you are not able to install the 10th ten, version then you have to run this command also but in the 99% cases this command alone is fine all right and after that we have to go with this command ng new and your project name let's say my project name is youtube then uh, we can just go with that and after that we just need some more commands i will tell you in the live example so just uh, i'm just going to show you my folder let's desktop then here you can see that this is my folder and I'm just going to install the uh, Angular CLI. But before that, we have to check that node and npm is installed or not. So just right here, node minus v and node is installed here. That's great. And then just right here, npm minus v. This is also installed. Great. And now we have to just write here, npm install minus g i will tell you the meaning of minus g within a moment and then just you have to write here at the rate angular slash cli right and uh, here minus g means global all right and when we are installing global anything in the uh, ubuntu or mac then we must have to use here sudo if you have a window system then we don't need to use the sudo here right and just put the password right so now you can see that is this is just uh, starting the installation and uh, it will just take uh, two to three minutes so i'm just going to pause the video for a moment great so this is installed now so now let's check out the version of the ng or you can say that the uh, angular cli uh, ng version and here you can see that our Angular CLI version is 10 and Angular is also so 10, Angular Core is also 10. That's great. So we don't need the second command, right? Maybe you, you will need it, you will need that, then you can just copy this command from the description box if you want, right? And now just simply write here ng new and your project name. Let's say my project name is uh, blog or my app or whatever just want to put, right? So just write here blog and now it will ask you some question like uh, would you like to add the angular routing and on yes i just want to use the routing because i have to make the tutorial on it then it will ask for the css what kind of uh, style format we just want to use so we will use obviously css right and now uh, when you just come on here because we are in the same folder then you can see that uh, uh, lots of files are created here and now it is creating the node module folder right so for checking that our uh, uh, what is the current version of our angular and all you can just simply go on the package.json and here you will find that angular 10 is installed here that's great that's that we actually want right so now let's uh, wait for a moment to installing the package then we will run it on the browser also so uh, angular project is completely installed here and node model folder is also there so now we can just run here ls or uh, this command for the uh, ubuntu and otherwise you can directly write here cd and just go inside the your project name and now just write here ng serve right and now it will just make a development build or you can say that the bundling the file and uh, after that we are able to run it on the browser right so a uh, dev build is also done here so now let's come to the browser and just simply write here localhost 
and 4200. So here you can see that this is uh, completely installed. So if you just want to make any file change, then you have to go inside the app dot uh, component dot HTML. Uh, I will just tell you the first change, right? Otherwise, we will learn the everything in the next video. We will see the folder structure and all. We will see step by step. But for a moment, for your curiosity, I just want to show you the first change. All right. So if you just we write here hello, then you will find that this thing is come here. Right. So here you can see that how we can install the Angular project and uh, run it. If you still have any kind of confusion, you can ask me in the comment box. Don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video. Bye bye. Take care.